I've had it confirmed yesterday from South Tyneside Council that the remaining Tutor Raid and Cruden Hut Youth Club will be getting demolished to make way for the 300 houses planned for Tutor Raid site. All of the football pitches will be gone that you can see here. So at risk there's the youth provision, football pitches, community open spaces, the mature trees here along the perimeter, there will be an increase in traffic of an estimated 600 cars and this traffic number will feed into the figures to possibly push the need for the environmentally destructive flyover. The flyover could cause Galsworthy Road and Benton Road to become a rat run. Consultation period ends August the 14th. You can email any objections to local.plan at southtyneside.gov.uk. I've spoke to the people in charge here who say that they've got all sorts happening here. They've got karate, youth clubs, dancing, about 10 different things happening. There's businesses in the upper area of the building as well. New businesses. People rely on Tutor Reid. But it all really needs something for the youths to be able to come to, to be together so they're not hanging around on streets with people complaining of antisocial behaviour. It's really important to save areas like Tutor Reid. I did ask the point of question what will happen to youth provision in the area if this is removed and they said as it's at the early stages they haven't actually got anything in place yet but the developer will have to um, contribute to off-site provisions so somewhere around South Tyneside and they don't specify where they will try and um, create new things for people to do I think or incorporate them into what's already there but um, I think what's important is that um, the community know what's at risk they know that Tutor Reid and the hut will be getting demolished for the 300 houses if approved for the next stage of the draft local plan. So remember to make your voice heard, get in touch with South Tyneside Council or not before the 14th August.